What's up YouTube, I am JoJ25 and in today's video I'm going to be teaching you guys how to basically create your own outro on Panzoid and also help you guys out with adding your own music and uh, changing the text size and text color and the background of your outro or intro, whatever it could be because this can you can use all this what I'm giving you to make an intro as well because it's all that same editing format but other than that, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and hit the notification button. I really appreciate it. And without further ado, let's get into the video. So first things first, you gotta make sure you're on your, you know, like you're on a computer, and then go to Panzoid, uh, Panzoid.com, and then it'll bring you to this screen right here. All you wanna do now is go to More Creations, and then look up something you want. Uh, I, you guys can see, I had like, I wanna look up uh, outro, uh, cause I'm doing outro. But you, you can look up like Minecraft or something like that. Um, like whatever you want your background to be and I'm just gonna look up some straight up outro uh, I'm gonna choose we'll just go with a simple one like this so click on it and then open in clip maker uh, Next what you want to do is you want to watch to see uh, how your um, intro or outro is so let's watch and see what it like how what it's about All right, so it's pretty cool because it is not like crazy. It's just a simple, I guess you say boring outro, but that's not really the point of this video to make it crazy one. You can see it has some cool animation ones here and all this stuff, but it's not the really point of this video is really just to teach you how to edit and everything. So first things first, we're gonna I'm gonna teach you guys how to change text. Uh, so how to change the text of you know your background, or whatever. So you have Ketchup Roblox. That's not my name, or that's not what I want. I want it to be you know thanks for watching. So you're gonna go to this. Everything's done in here basically. This you know square looking thing. So you go to text, and then I want to put thanks for watching as, you know, it's the outro, makes sense. So you're going to put in, you know, thanks for watching, or whatever you want, it doesn't matter. You do whatever you want. And then you're going to notice a big problem, you know, the size of it. So to change the size, all you want to do is just literally go to height, and then make it 12, or whatever you want. You can see you fixed it right there. Make sure you do it for the other one, though, because, uh, you know, you got to be balanced, and then you can see right there, it looks pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, also, you could change the font. I'm not really gonna do that. Um, I'm just gonna keep it the way it is. I like it, like the one, the preset. So I'm not gonna change the font. Um, so yeah, I'll keep it that. Uh, what else can we do here? Uh, you also can change the uh, random video or previous video. You could change that text right here. But that's basically about it for this outro. It's only only text you could change. There's nothing else. Uh, next, we're gonna change the background. So this is how you change like your background color and all that. So it's all the shape. So everything with the shape is the color. So you can see you have the blue and black. That's what my background is. Maybe we can make that uh, yellow. It'll probably look very weird. Yes, it will. <laughs> but that's basically what it does. You know, you, you can, you know, change the colors and everything. Uh, maybe we'll make this red. How does that look? That well, looks pretty cool. You know, it doesn't even matter. Like I said, it's just really just trying to teach you guys what to do. But yeah, you can do whatever you want. Also, I don't know if I didn't mention this, but you can change the color of the text as well. You know, to whatever you want. Maybe we'll make that yellow. Uh, I mean, it's all right. <laughs> it's not the greatest, but you know, it's whatever. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's terrible. Ah, eh, who cares? Uh, I'll just keep it like this for now. Who cares? Uh, all right. So now you know how to like change your stuff. You can also change this to the squares right here. You can see it's black, so you can make that uh, blue if you want, or whatever you want. You know, that's basically all you have to do. Shapes are, you know, the shapes. Pretty obvious. And then text, you know, the text. Uh, light, I don't really mess with that, so I wouldn't really mess with that. And then what else? Anything else? That's really it. Yeah, you can see it. Shape, text, and yeah, that's basically it. So that's how you change all that stuff around. Uh, next uh, is the music. I know a lot of you guys are probably wondering how do you change the music, which is probably the biggest question that has been unanswered for a while. So how do you change the music and how do you get free music that you can take from anywhere? So just go to YouTube and then look up something you want. Anything. It could be anything, but I would make sure it has a free next to it. Because if it doesn't have free next to it, potentially it could be copyright. Uh, not all of them that doesn't have this are like, you know, copyrighted, but you know, if you're picking like a rapper song, like a brand new album that just came out and you want to like copy that brand new song because everyone's listening to it, it's a, you know, really good song or something, you know, I just want to let you know that, you know, yeah, you could use it, but you're going to get, uh, you know, you're not going to get monetization on that video that you use that, you know, outro on, you know, whatever you use that music on, you're not going to get, you're going to get copyrighted and uh, you may be, you may, they may take it down, but usually you just don't get monetized, um, so if you're a channel that is not monetized right now, then go ahead. You can use it, and then when you get monetized, and just make sure you change it. But yeah, I would definitely have something free, because if you use something free, then you're fine. So all you got to do is just literally just copy the link. So copy, and then you're going to go to YouTube um, to uh, the G converter. So let me actually copy it. 
because I don't think I actually have a music already. Uh, you guys can see right here. Uh, that's what it is. It's called Shark MP4. So let me actually go back for you guys. It's called Shark MP4. Uh, so YouTube MP3. And then dot .mp4 mp3 because it's an audio. So I just paste your link, convert, and then uh, you just wait. Now, I just want to let you guys know this is a safe site. Uh, just make sure you click out of the ad. And I'll show you guys right now what, what I mean by that. So, like I said, this is a safe site. Just make sure on the ad, like when that website pops up, you just click out of it. So, download, and then you're just going to cancel right there. And then now it's downloading right here. Have we already done? Let's see. Oh, yeah, it's done. You can hear it. Yep. So it's all done. Okay, perfect. Now you're gonna go back to uh, your clip maker, and now you're gonna go to select audio file. It should be the first thing in downloads. Yes, it is. You're gonna just double clap it, and then let's hear it. Let's see if it uh, if it works. Hey. Now you obviously want to make it dope and everything, so you want to find like when the beat drops. 32, and then when is so 32, 32, 32, so 30. So you're gonna put it to 30, which is a pretty cool feature. And now let's uh, let's listen to it. Hey, you know it's not a good looking outro, but it's dope. I like it. So that's pretty cool. That's what you can do. It's awesome. That's the easiest way. And then listen, if you want to, like what I usually do, I just literally go back to my files and I just delete what I just did. You know, I just make sure obviously I save everything. But yeah, so that's basically all you have to do. Now, you know, you can go up here or right here and you can like set the video resolution, whatever uh, frame doesn't matter. Um, do whatever you want, you know, and you can also trim the length of the video if it's too long. 13 seconds, 13.7 seconds is too long because you can trim it. Just 13, whatever you want. So next, last time I think all you got to do is download. So just uh, download it and uh, you say start video vendor. You, you click that and then it's going to ask you to download it. So it's rendering, once it's done rendering, then it's gonna ask you to download it, and then you download it, and then you're good to go. That's basically all you guys have to do to, um, you know, do all this. Uh, and then, obviously, now you can just bring it to your YouTube. So that's basically all you guys have to do um, to make an outro. It's easy as that. You literally take any outro you want and just edit it to yourself. Like, this is what this website's for. It's for creators who want to make stuff and want people to use their stuff, and then you can, like, just use their stuff and just edit off what you want, you know? So... That's what's it, guys. If you guys have any questions, just let me know down below in the comments section down below. Um, that's going to wrap it up for this video. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully I helped you out. Uh, but that's the updated 2021 guide of uh, Panzoid. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.